So, uh, I guess this is it. Alright, alright. Oh, no, we gotta restart. You said it wrong. Hold on, hold So, uh, welcome to Edit It Out. Uh, this is our first official podcast. Let's edit that out. Edit How about that, that out, you, go. you <laughs> slut. <laughs> Brendan, please edit yeah. that out. Yes. Oh, <laughs> yes, sir. Thank you, sir. No, no, <laughs> that's a bad name. <laughs> so, um, I guess this is our first podcast. I'm not really sure this is on a run, so if y'all want to keep fucking listening, I guess go for it. <clears throat> is that even, like, recording? I don't think you have a choice. It's not fucking recording. It looks really quiet. It's really it's fucking quiet. <laughs> There's... Just go! Anyways, um, this is one of the this is one of the marvels of modern technology. We haven't even got to the yeah. name of this thing. So, uh, you you can, you can, you can, I guess we can record things and, it and watch as it's happening. So we're about I'm to be Greg. <laughs> so Greg. You see her voice. Um, yeah. You have to drink baddies for a show. So we're a bunch of people here. Yeah, we, we do are. stuff. We yeah, decided we're what people we on each other. We decided we decided to make a podcast about really pretty much. Anything, 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 anything and everything. So today's topic is going to be walls. Um, <laughs> walls? So, uh, what do you guys think of drywall? Are, are we including drywall? Are we Wait, including drywall? warts with walls or just walls? <clears throat> walls. Okay. Everything. No warts. Everything walls. Alright. As a construction worker, I hate drywall. No, this is a stupid conversation. We're not actually going to fucking have this conversation. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe you did it. I'm going to edit that out. an hour and a half because people want to fucking listen to this. <laughs> hey, you never know. Your, someone you might want that. that out. You got um, your four basic types of drywall. So I guess, uh, so I you guess got, um, you got your, your mold resistant, your moisture resistant, <laughs> water resistant, and your standard... Gypsum or basic drywall. food groups. Water is moisture. Beans, you bacon, whiskey. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's it's fucking retarded. Fucking oh, drywall is retarded. <laughs> Wait, I'm like talking about, about, about fucking it. walls right now. I'm sorry. Did okay, someone say we're talking about drywall? Really talking about drywall? Right now? Why are we talking about drywall? Okay, anyway, no, 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 no. How about so, because Korea. of this idiot right here? North Korea people. North Korea just said they're gonna attack America. Let's get on something serious. That's politics. political. No, that's not no, politics. no, no politics. No, fuck up. Get the fuck out. Edit no. that shit out. Red Dawn fucking bombed. Red Dawn was shit. Red Dawn bombed. Anyway, anyway, so Red Dawn's the remake of Spock. What the hell? So, so I, I got a. I got a funny story here. So me and Tux were driving here, and uh, <laughs> this fucking asshole. Is, that is literally how every story Fuck starts. Fuck you! Is this fucking asshole? Uh, so this guy over here, we're fucking walking over here, and you we have like we put have, your thumb into my eye while you're doing this. <laughs> this guy over here. So anyway, um, if you hear we, someone we had, scream, it's because Sebastian stabbed his thumb into my eye. Thanks. <laughs> we have to so uh, go to the hospital. Now. We had we had undesignated fucking uh, merchandise toy. That Tux is carrying. We're not going to say what it is because fuck you and you guys don't get to know. We had an undesignated merchandise toy. And Tux is like waving it around. And there's some fucking kid about it. Gently. Yeah, stroking it gently. There's some fucking kid like, why are you carrying She's like, fuck you, I carry whatever unregistered merchandise toy I want. And so the kid was like, oh, fuck this. And she's just like, I'm going inside now. And Tux basically accomplished to scare the fucking shit out of a child. What is that? Like literally right outside Robert's house. Yeah. Oh, okay. He's gonna scare like, away all my fucking neighbors. Yeah, all his neighbors. And then, and then the last so, time we were here. So those guys over there, they're, they love me. They right? can't see what you're pointing at. Because you're in a video. <laughs> fucking idiot. Anyway. Don't so my neighbors think across, Tux is a dragon right Yes. Now. They think I'm a fucking dragon. They were like babies. Because I, I shouted at them very loudly the other <laughs> night while I was super inebriated. And whipping your dick out. They did Tux wearing a suit like Tux. Motherfucker like back there goddamn gave me Captain Morgan Black. Yeah, anyway, but who gave you the idea to go out there and whip your dick out? I think it was this motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> whip your dick out. And, See? I, I, I will. Dragon I, and I and know. Arm. But yeah, no, so like... Sebastian's like, hey, Tux, you should go fucking, uh... I, I, I can assure you... Flash the neighbors. I can assure you right now I did not once say, hey, go whip your dick out. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what universe somebody, you live in. Somebody said, you should go flash to the neighbors. And I'm like, all right. And I go up, I'm like, hey! Someone in there dared me to flash you guys. Here goes. <laughs> Whoop. And fucking I did. And then it goes <laughs> helicoptering. I was. I was like, woo! <laughs> anyway, off the concept of drunken asshole stories, which is, we all have one. But uh, just so you guys know, we play. If you guys know what Cards Against Humanity is, well, go kill yourself. Um, I know. Uh, <laughs> like and there we lost any subscribers. <laughs> yeah. oh, goodbye. We don't, really yeah. to, we don't really want you to kill yourself. No, we don't. Love you. But fucking basically, basically, so our first Tux, episode we lost everyone. Yeah. So, yeah. so, so fucking. Because <laughs> they all killed like, themselves. No, so, so Tux. <laughs> Anyway, um, so basically, um, we play Cards Against Humanity, and Tux has, like, the cards, 
He has the card. Against uh, humanity. Uh, the cards against <laughs> humanity. And so all of his cards that are like... Uh, the way that works is that you get a phrase and you have to fill in a blank. <laughs> it's like apples to apples. It's like apples to apples. But for really, horrible people. For horrible people. Um, and so Tux has drunken his drunken stories. <laughs> he drank his drunken um, stories? <laughs> fuck you. What the fuck is this? So he has his <laughs> drunken stories that's like... Oh, what episode uh, is this? Get me. Are we, we're recording a fucking podcast this episode. What episode is this? It's Double Rainbow. Anyway. So, um... Uh, basically, he has all these fucking drunken stories of himself. They're, they're fantastic. And they're fantastic. My favorite one is the one where he, uh... Where, where you... Where he passed out in the tub? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And... <laughs> Did you bring that with you? No, no I, I didn't bring it. I, I, I didn't bring it. We have another computer. If, we can play the online one. If I had been... Yeah, we have the online one. But if I had been told to bring Cards Against Humanity, I would have brought it. But we're not going to play them. <coughs> so we were told that we were going to try to do... Anyway. Oh. So, okay, here's how the story goes. Um, I was in the middle of a That's a great way to <laughs> Now that you're all so, good and depressed. <laughs> I was in the middle of a divorce. Oh, this a bit Everyone feel like you. shit now, please. That's probably, yeah, the, that's probably the best way to start mm, a drunk Killing story. myself is sounding really good right now. That's <laughs> <laughs> well, um, if we have it in the the before, before you finish this story, I think it's we should all... your wife listening, that's it. I think, I think we should all introduce it's ourselves. We completely forgot to introduce ourselves. It's a little late for that, don't you? It's very late. Let's do it right now. No. So, I'm Sebastian. Fuck it. Good for you. I'm all Craig. I'm all no. Craig. <laughs> that asshole is Tux. <laughs> this fucking quiet motherfucker over there, you guys can't see where I'm poning, but just pretend. Yeah, you pretend can Pretend that I'm through, poning. Yeah, you can see through the internet, obviously. We can all see oh, how wow. smart Wait, it is. I'm Wait just... Wait not fucking imply that we watch... <laughs> yeah. Well, on the first wait, episode, you have to take that out. Wait, 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 that's your job. We watch... Edit that, <laughs> Edit that out. Edit that out. I don't want to hang out with the fans anymore. <laughs> <laughs> no. You're going to hit the most hard. <laughs> All right. So who All else is it. who? Right. We only introduced like three fucking people. Oh, I'm going to go get a butter horn. Uh, I'm Robert or Rob or whatever else. Rob. Whatever Robert. nickname ends up happening because that happens to me. I'm nickname person. Or hey, the guy hey. with the bruised shoulder because he's sitting next to me. Actually, that's probably going to change every that's episode. Why I moved, I sat on the <laughs> no shit, why do you think we're over here? <laughs> uh, I can you? take it like a man, sorry. Oh. oh. Bad <laughs> um, So who the fuck are you? I don't I don't think I want to punch in my ass. I'd rather punch him. Yeah, who me. are you? What are who you are doing you? to this guy? Get a powder horn on your mouth. <laughs> punch him. <laughs> I no, I don't think so. I don't think, <laughs> I don't think so. you can have that out. So, um, who are you? I'm Otter. <laughs> no, you're Matt. No, because plausible deniability. <laughs> <laughs> That's yeah. Matt. Out of my computer. Uh, who are you? Steven? Um, <clears throat> Steven. Yeah, he's Steven. I'm Steven. And this other motherfucker here is Breton. Breton, say hi. Hi. He's sure. the guy with the fucking dick in his mouth. Yeah, you can tell. <laughs> so, so much for introducing yourself. That's a dick in my mouth. Girl. That's a really bad first impression, dude. What? That's a really bad first impression. <laughs> Hello, internet. I love dicks you know, in my mouth. A much, a much better first impression is all the drunken stories. Yeah. Oh yeah. All, all the drunken stories. That's what I was. <laughs> but I was uh, speaking. Speaking of, I need more to finish story. That. Yeah. Let, please let my first story be how I whip my dick out in public. <laughs> <laughs> Much better first impression. Hey, at least they know what they're getting into. <laughs> exactly. Well, now you guys know what this is. There was one. At least I won't have to worry about listeners finding out. It's going to be as bad <laughs> yeah. or worse than this. You're going to watch. Time. You're going to listen to this. Parent discussion advised. Highly advised. If you don't want to listen to your own discretion, if you don't want to listen to tags, stay the fuck away from me. Just this one on the street. You better walk away. Um, Stephanie looked up that plushie, and she's like, what's uh, that plushie? And she's like, oh wait, I looked it up. I wish I hadn't. <laughs> Which the, the pencil sharpener you, one, right? The pencil yeah. sharpener. They're oven mitts. Uh, yeah. this, this, is, this is a terrible um, first topic, so I'm going to continue. Anyway, so, so like, I'm in the middle of a I'm in the middle of a I'm hanging out with this chick I'm trying to date, and my Keep fucking calling me. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. And thanks for the confidence, <laughs> asshole. Uh, um, but so I'm the smart my my Nice to meet you. My <laughs> keeps calling, and I'm just like, oh, you fucking bitch. So, um, I end, up, I end up going mm-hmm. home and, uh, I heard you know, have. just downing bottles of wine. I have like three and a half bottles, and then I just black out. I call the chick I'm <clears throat> that I'm trying to get with. <laughs> 
And she meant she somehow talks me into taking a shower while I'm blacked out. This not that <laughs> not that uh, amazing of an accomplishment when you think about it. But <laughs> so like I end up I don't see how. being just like passed out in the tap in the sh- uh, shower tub thing, and I'm puking all over myself. I wake my mom up, and like you know she comes, she comes, she comes, she opens the door, and she's like. And, like, she rips open the shower, and she's like, Are you okay? I'm like, and I look at my chest, there's just red shit all over me. <laughs> I'm like, that's not supposed to be there. And she's like, well, fucking finish your shower and go to fucking bed. I need to sleep. I got work in the fucking morning, you <laughs> drunk-ass motherfucker. Okay. You were discretion is advice. <laughs> Is this when you told her? You were listening. Please look at a wall while you watch this. (laughs) (laughs) I'm sorry, listen, not watch. It can only go up from here, people. (laughs) Excelsior! (laughs) It will get worse. Uh, So anyway, um... Okay, let's let's, let's jump to another topic. Who here's the Bioshock Infinite yet? Anybody here? I haven't seen, like, the first 40 minutes. I haven't gotten the girl yet. Um, who here... Okay, for, for you guys that don't know, me being the fucking massive no lifer that I Did am. Did you already beat it? I beat it. Jeez, is that short? It. No, it's it, it's like like twelve hours yeah, long. It's long. But Sebastian here is like, okay, it's twelve o'clock at night. Man, that's like seven hours to play Bioshock. So I just <laughs> went for it and beat it. There you go. Um, but I'll look play okay, today. for for people who are listening to this and know what I'm talking about, that fucking ending. I will not say shit to you guys, but that ending is like the trippiest fucking ending I've ever seen. It's just like. It's really, uh, it's written in a manner that's just so... Brett knows what I'm talking about. It's, it's okay. Room, it, 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 it's a cliffhanger. That's what I want to know. <laughs> no. No, it's And not. he knows what I'm talking about. Isn't it fucking crazy it's, shit? It's, it's stupid. I mean, for God's sake, it's just... It, it comes out of, like... No, like, no, no, it's not stupid. It's so much build to it. It's so well done. Yeah, it, well, no, it's just the way that it's, like, written and everything. It's like, I couldn't fully understand okay, it. Okay, next podcast, we'll actually talk about the ending, so spoiler you know, alert. You know, I could not care less if the ending is stupid, as long I am just freaking... Sick of games setting themselves up for sequels. Yeah. Oh no, Bioshock Infinite is not going to sequel. That's what I'm saying. I'm it's glad it's not going to be a sequel. That's why I don't. I don't so, it can be as dumb as it wants to. It gets all the credit. But but that, here's the cool thing. Here's the cool thing about Bioshock Infinite that Ken Levine said. Because he's doing DLC for it, and he's like, okay, so we're only going to do three DLCs, but he's just going to be pretty big and pretty expansive. Because for you guys that don't know, the whole concept of Bioshock Infinite is that there's infinite dimensions. And that, that uh, the basic point is the chick you get Elizabeth can open terrors as she calls them, which allows you to jump from dimension Way to dimension. Run it. Yeah, no, no, but it's it's, it's, <laughs> it's really cool. The whole cool. point of the game. Yeah, it's the whole point of the game. girl. Like, yeah. It's spoiler. It's in the trailer. Look, it's like a trailer. You, you, yeah. I don't like to <laughs> spoil anything for me. So, uh, so fucking now he's upset. It's okay. I love him. Aww, <laughs> it's okay. Now. He's no. crying. We'll, we'll make cute. up. But hurt count one. Make up or make out. A little bit of both. So, uh, so anyway, basically. Ken Levine was like, Make the penises kiss! No! Get out of here! Get out of here! And then they, oh, yeah. and then they all fucked. Now everybody's gonna be wondering, what the fuck are they talking about? Make the penises? Anyway, so Ken Levine was saying, Ken Levine was saying, That's exactly what it sounds like. <laughs> so Ken, Le- Ken Levine. Yay, space docking! So Ken Levine was saying that all the DLC for that game was gonna take place in alternate dimensions, which leads there to be that there's gonna be like such a. They can do pretty much fucking anything with that. I saw that they were talking about they were have the season pass with DLC. I was like, how is there DLC? Yeah, but it's this? infinite dimensions. They can do whatever the fuck they want. It's cool. They can do like a dimension where like Booker never gets to Elizabeth, and it's like you play that, and there's a dimension where you play as fucking Elizabeth. I don't know. Elizabeth. They can do so much cool shit with that because it's alternate dimensions. That's, I find yeah, so fucking cool, cool about cool, that actually. game. That's both incredibly cool and an amazing cop out. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it is. Oh, now we can do it any way. Was our last one shitty? That's okay. This one's completely different. <laughs> so, okay, no, but it's, it's being hailed as, like, the best thing since... The best actual legitimate single-player game since Half-Life 2. Okay. About my own time, I'm sick of... Oh, every game doesn't need multiplayer. Exactly. Yeah, no. no it's exactly. Every single game player, is multiplayer. If none of us have friends... <laughs> <laughs> then what are we? Then what are yeah, yeah, how 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 are we? We're the street. We're tolerances. Who are you? Are you? <laughs> yeah, if y'all don't know, we walked around and asked all these guys to group up tonight. Yeah, yeah. they said they hey, you look cool. Beer. You want some free beer? Half of the people in here were passed out under a bridge. Troll hunter. Probably one of us was passed out somewhere. We're not going to point any fingers. <laughs> you wouldn't be able to see it over the internet anyway. But um, Ooh, but uh, pictures, it's okay. Yeah. No, but but for for real though, if you guys haven't had a chance to pick up Bioshock, I highly recommend it. 
I don't, I don't, well, I'm not, this is an advertising podcast, but just, like, that is something that, as somebody who studies and does game development, it is such a fucking feat, because it's something that isn't seen so often in the game development world. Normally you get shit like fucking Modern Warfare. Oh, this is so cool. You just shoot the gun, and it's the same six games for the next 12 years. Yeah. yeah. Bioshock Infinite is such a feat upon itself, because it's something that... It has a story behind it. It has a story behind it, and it's something that I haven't seen Mm -hmm. since the last half of the Okay. Yeah. Okay, I have a co-worker who swears by every single fucking Modern Warfare game. I'm like, dude, you're a fucking tool. Learn how to good taste in games. The only reason why Modern Warfare does so well, and same thing with Battlefield, and I, you know, I love you know, I love Battlefield. So because but the, 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 idiots, well, yeah, no, I well, get no, it. No, 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 I'm just saying because the multiplayer is good. It's fun okay. to play. No, 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 you hold get on. out. Hold You're on. not allowed oh. here anymore. What am I going to do with today? Not fucking this. And now we have our first prediction of the golf cup. Okay, so anyway, I was going to bring up bring up was. Hideo Kojima actually now, uh, announced the new. Oh Metal my Gear god! It looks so fucking good. But it was it's funny pain. because he he basically posted something on on the Fuck VGA, you, like it, posting this this Gives Phantom Pain video. No one knew it, but some people actually kind of hinted that oh, this is the next Metal Gear. Yeah, because if you collect all the lines. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. So then that, 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 that took a little while for people to realize. Okay, hold on, hold on. Man. You don't like Metal Gear? No, Hideo Kojima. All he does is jerk off in a literary fashion. But if, and if you want done, and if you want fucking Japanese people to masturbate in your face for three hours, there's a lot of places on the internet you can go and not pay sixty dollars for it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. For real. the thing yeah. is, Hideo Kojima actually makes it so like, okay, here, here's our, here's our concept, but we're not telling you what it is. But then it makes you think later. And I, then I, will, I will like, oh my fucking god, it's like lost well, just that. because he doesn't know what it is. <laughs> <laughs> Six hours in, he goes. <clears throat> Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. This is a game. <laughs> oh, what's my code word? Uh, nano machines. How many sentences per minute can I get that word in? <laughs> I love how he, actually. Well, I watched the the interview on GT Trails, and they were all like, you know, and, the, and the guy was all like, um, so what? What about Raiden? Or Raiden? Are you can play that. They're like, oh, he's like, oh hell no, no, you you can go play Revengeance if you want to play Raiden. <laughs> Raiden. And I was like, this is basically just saying Raiden was a horrible character <laughs> that we created. Oh yeah, he was not a bad him. No, we're um, much more interested in Solid Snake, the geriatric with. The gay love but child. This isn't... <laughs> you talk about Sonny? I guess, yeah. <laughs> I don't even fucking know what I'm talking about. It's just a gay <laughs> fucking love child. Um, oh, okay. I, I, I'm so, assuming you've never played any of them. So I guess... I guess I, not past, like, one. So I guess uh, that, that's it for video game talk. Um, well, actually, no, not really. But yeah, but gonna, we'll, we'll it, get into it. it. it Podcast over, no, Leaf. No, you know, can, I like how official we, you know, we are. Can, can we talk about Let's something stop. about Bioshock Infinite really quick? There's one more thing I want to mention about that. What? The covers. The song covers. Oh my god! Can we talk about that? Because those are amazing. Talk about the actual the yeah, covers like, of the thing. Like the the God only knows how. Like that. Like that. Just like, oh, oh, those covers. I thought you were yeah. talking about the actual. No, covers. Okay. No, the song <laughs> this, is, this, is a, this isn't a fucking spoiler, but um, there's a point in Bioshock Infinite because like I guess you're wandering around, and you'll find random tears that have like songs from like 1980 and 1960 playing in like, that gave a good touch to it though. Yeah. And it's so funny because we're walking around one point, and um, and you jump in this building, and all you hear is the fucking. All you hear is girls just want to have fun. <laughs> so, <laughs> like playing shoot shit, and all you hear is girls just want to have fun. And then Booker's just like, what the fuck is this shit? <laughs> and it's like, who on earth would actually listen to this? <laughs> so what did I want in the 1980s? And Elizabeth's like, this isn't too bad. No, this is horrible. <laughs> this is horrible. Why would you listen to this? Because well, she wants to have fun, obviously. Yeah, I just want to have fun. I'm not going to lie, though. Um, last thing I'm watching a bit before I stop having my fucking nerdgasm over it. Elizabeth is the greatest fucking, most amazing AI engine I've ever seen in a fucking video game. She's that is the good. most responsive AI companion character I've ever fucking seen. No. No, well, yeah, it kind of is, but it's, it's just like... She throws you ammo when... She, she just, it's just items. the way that she acts. It's like... It's like legitimately having a partner. Like, you knew, it's like you're playing with you the co-op that you needed right. ammo. She immediately yeah. Boom. It's oh, he's like, so fucking go. cool. You'll be in the middle of combat, like fuck. I'm alone. Help out here's Booker, and you turn around, and fucking med pack gets thrown in your face, and you just grab it. And you're like, yes. <laughs> Booker, here's some money. Booker, here's ammo. Booker, 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 Booker. There you go. She said that was just under Booker. Like, I barely even know her. But I'm Tish. No, it's like the it's like the AI director in Left for Dead. What I was in the line waiting for. We have a prize getting handed out today. <laughs> <laughs> I was waiting in line for the game. And like everyone, a lot of people were already complaining about the fact that the actual <laughs> yay prize. It's a shitty game. What's stop the prize? Oh. It's a game stop for us. Something to Did you ever heard of that EA uh, badge holder? Oh bullshit? wait, hold on. We oh god, damn it! But me and Tux have a story from the Bioshock game for the long time. Hold on. Best 
fucking thing we've ever experienced. So we go oh, there. Oh, no, no. Yes, yes, no. the Microsoft no. store lady. No. The Microsoft store lady. Okay, now let, it, let us tell the story. Be good. So me and Tux go to the Bioshock Infinite Lawn, and we went to Vert's for the first time, which is this place where we live. It, um, fucking awesome. Kebab it's sandwich. a kebab sandwich place. It's really good. Yeah, if you guys haven't been to Burst, go check it out. It's like a fucking. Uh, yeah, it's, it's free awesome. advertising. <laughs> free advertising. You, you are guys. welcome, Burt's. <laughs> edit that out. Um, anyway, uh, so basically, um, <laughs> we're waiting in line. No. Fucking. So we we were sitting there in line chilling, and this is this really cool guy's next to us, and all of a sudden, this fucking woman in a tracksuit like runs up to us. Oh no no like, no! Okay, before that. They were like, hey, you guys are free, sir. Have some thunder sticks. We're like, yeah, yeah, yeah thunder sticks. Oh, we just start whacking <laughs> thunder sticks <laughs> outside of the thunder sticks. <laughs> <Yeah, laughs> like this. Yeah, thunder sticks. Just okay. whacking them. If you guys know what thunder sticks are, like two balloons, and you smack them together, they make like a really loud fucking noise. <laughs> yeah. And so we're just sitting there smacking thunder sticks, and this woman comes up to us, and she's like, hey. And we're like, hey, are you here for the Bioshock release? She's like, no. I heard you guys. Yeah, no, and noise. she says, what it, was she that says about? it. She's in this really mysterious. She's like, hey, hey, do you guys like video games? No, that's why no, we're, we're sitting here at okay, 12 of the night for fucking video game. <laughs> Are you going hey, to molest me? Hey, 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 you guys, you guys should go to the Microsoft store. Hey, and then she says the most insulting thing I've heard all night about about What's that game that's launching tonight? Because it's not as good as Cures of War Judgment. <laughs> oh. I just stared at her like, Are you <laughs> fucking retarded? <laughs> you just came to a midnight release. Okay. Oh, yeah, no, 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 like, she <laughs> actually said that shit, and we're just like, Ugh. I started crying. I was like, Can we? <laughs> Almighty Ken Levine, please strike this heathen down. This I know, and then she says, "Hey, you guys should go to the Microsoft store." And I asked her, "You guys have an launch for Bioshock Infinite?" No. Then why the fuck would I go there? <laughs> and she's <laughs> like, "She's like, we let you wait inside, and we feed you." Yeah, what? One slice of Little Caesars, hot and ready. <laughs> <laughs> no, and then it's funny because no, the game stuff that's play, exactly what the, I fu- want the fucking game stuff play runs out, and she just books it. Oh, she yeah. runs, she and bull- it was funny. It was yeah, funny. and I was like. Oh, and as she's telling us, I'm like, are you are you scalping customers? Is that what's going on here? <laughs> yes. And she's like, no. I'm like, that's what you're fucking doing. You're telling like, us to go to the other store. But no, well, we were in, when I was at the so game the, uh, store. All the, okay, all the game stuff. sub employees, like, they start talking about it, and they're like, oh, shit. And they start calling up people and, you know, like, making a huge deal about it. And then, uh, like, 15, 20 minutes later, they come out, and they're like, Hey! <laughs> Let's go to the Microsoft store! <laughs> also, it was funny because she the way she acted, she acted like we were men that have never fucking seen a woman in our entire lives. I was like, well, you were in front of a GameStop. Yeah, and, uh, you fucking uh, and, and I'm over here, I'm like, hi, I'm... <laughs> that That's his best point, by the way. You're going to hear that a lot. His argument, uh, hey, well, you know what? Well, I've been... Hey, God, yeah, hey, well, lady. I've been... <laughs> hey, so lady, guess you. what? He is single. He's single, ladies. <laughs> ladies. I think all the two of us are single. Three okay. of us. Now, let me, let, me paint you. Let, let, me, let me paint you an image of him. He's okay. single, but he mostly sees double. Beautiful, inspiring <laughs> image of him. So, go to the nearest bar you can. <laughs> And now stand outside and wait until 2 in the morning. <laughs> when the guy that comes out going, yeah, I need more! And then collapses on the floor and just sits there, that's him. <laughs> but wait, 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 wait. Eat. No, okay, you have, to, you have to give him two shots of fireball, and if that sobers him up, that's me. <laughs> this motherfucker gets sober from drinking more whiskey. <laughs> it's magical. Like me and Robert were there. was like, Tuck's passed out again. And, 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 and so I like, lay hey. on the couch and they're like, no, no. I'm like, give me more fireball. And I'm telling Tuck that I'm leaving right now. And he's still passed out. And yeah, he's like, and fireball. So I, take, like, I take two shots. I'm like, all right, let's go. No, you didn't say let's go. You said I'm good to drive. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. That, I'm fucking... good to drive. I was like, no, you're not. <laughs> yes, it's 24 minute mark. Are we really? Yeah. Wow, we're 24 minutes into the first official podcast. Remember, remember who you're killing. <laughs> we got another four more hours. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Brenton. This is not going to be a four hour yes. podcast. No. No one to listen to the whole four thing. Four more hours. Fuck no. Four, four more hours. Four, four more hours. And then just cut it right there. So I <laughs> love George <laughs> Bush. <laughs> Next time. <laughs> Next time on podcast. Next time on podcast. Will Tux ever sober up? Will George Bush ever be reelected? Will the <laughs> ever fly? I don't fucking know. Where is the lemonade made? Let's do this. <laughs> Are we still going? 
<laughs> oh, yeah, the podcast isn't over. Shit. Um, it can be. I can edit that part I, out. I just can't stop watching <laughs> turn into that door. That's <laughs> you what? Fat- I don't okay, so really I guess uh, like hey, yeah, we'll no, back no, back it now. looks like welcome back to podcast. It well, actually, we never even left. It, we were just it, in the middle of Tux calling Breton a faggot, but then, <laughs> but then Breton got so <laughs> no, offended that, that, that Breton left. That was me. Oh, that was Jesse no, calling Breton a faggot. He got so offended no, that he no, left. Jesse got faggot. so offended no, that Breton no, left. I'm the one that knew which character it was. Fuck you. Okay, okay. Shut the fuck up. Not anyway. But anyway, dude, like. I can smell that shit. I used to drink seven of those a fucking day. That's yeah, but I can't smell that from here. Those what, Chucks? We just fucking recording. monster. Yeah. Okay, we're talking about monster drinks now. God Apparently, Seb Dastin is only drinking. Seb Dastin? Seb English? <laughs> anyway, Sebastian. <laughs> Sebastian's drinking monster drink right now, and we're like, his and Tux is like, can you smell it from here? I'm like, no. In the interest of fairness to the audience, I'll let you know that we've had pizza and. Um, Lots of alcohol and quite a bit of alcohol in the break. So and, we're all um, a little and bit we're we're still warm. having alcohol. And, and we're the, all kind of out I'm there. Out of alcohol. Right. Don't, uh, don't forget to mention the failed card game. The failed uh, card game has yeah, happened. Yeah, so if you guys don't I know, I won that shit. But I had to okay. it three times. Right. Was a little the hiatus. only reason the only reason we failed at it is because you we are caring. we stopped caring. We stopped caring. But <laughs> we don't Cards Against caring. Humanity, great fucking game. Go play it. I hate you. Wait, what is? I blame Seb. Cards I'm, Against Humanity. What? You said it was yeah, you were the blame that fat ass. Boring. Like, this is boring. Yeah, blame, blame that, that, fat that ass. ass. No, blame fat that. ass. Fat ass. <laughs> Ow. Ow. I think. Head trauma on levels I've never experienced before. Where's Cole Phelps? <laughs> Where's Cole Phelps? <laughs> like Cole? Anyway, uh, I guess Cole Phelps. Uh, that's, uh, let's LA talk about Phelps. I know who he is. LA. Yeah, <laughs> I know. Like, like I there's know nobody said that. I know who he fucking I is. I know who he is. <laughs> God damn it. I, I will him. find him and I will kill him. Where's Harvey then? Punch my wolf. Where's Rachel? So, um, anyway, while, while, while this I'm is going on, cop. we started talking about Bruce Lee <clears throat> and Half Life. Unfortunately, some fucking people here were not intelligent enough to record that conversation. Not in, not <laughs> intelligent enough. I'm just uh, too lazy. asked. We Remember put it all away and then we lazy, took it back out so again. What the fuck, be dude? Asked. The Bruce Lee conversation was the best conversation we've had all fucking night. We were also standing 25 feet away from the microphone hey, at the hey, time. Read on. Hey, you want to know something? I can see my voice recording. Yeah, yeah you can. I can fucking see that shit. God damn it. It's because they're talking louder. Louder. God damn right. it, Tugs. <laughs> <laughs> we don't need to give him that information. Okay, okay, so I'm going to make this clear right now. It's going to pipe the damn thing. Yeah, this <laughs> fucking guy here. That's my edit mark. If I... <laughs> wait, wait. Oh, shit, son. Tux has hit the ground. It's like suckling from a teat. A whiskey teat. Whis- Tux is <laughs> chugging fireball right now. I read that thing. <laughs> <laughs> That's just gonna be my default. What, what is my, my life? That's my default answer for everything. What is my, my life? <laughs> what is my life? What is this? Um. So. Uh. Yeah. So I guess. Um. We were watching the IT crowd. We were. Uh, if you guys have never seen that, it's basically a British show about an IT crowd. And they got an IT department. No, was so. fucking talking, Stephen. And they got all their You're jokes from Monty the Python. He has the talking stick. I have the talking. stick. <laughs> Both and of them right. can talk louder. Anyway, before we get completely yeah, derailed, um, so we were talking about the IT crowd. We were watching it, and uh, I forgot where I was going with this. But all I know is that it's a good show, and everybody should watch it. Yes, I totally agree. Oh my god! At least once. Fucking oh! Did you break your? So are we ass? just are we just like promoting everything now? <laughs> Monster Fireball <laughs> IT crowd cards against humanity. You didn't break. Both are really good. <laughs> No, you should be a communist because it's really good. So <laughs> <laughs> everyone. Hey, By fire, I'm a little awakening. Just want to know that uh, Trojan condoms are very useful. <laughs> oh yeah. Bullshit. <laughs> Not according to your girlfriend. <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> anyway, good point. edit that out. Good point. Edit that out. Boy moment edit that out. Please, please edit that the fuck out. <laughs> 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 Ever again. I don't want to fucking hear that again. No. <laughs> so anyway, uh, let's. I guess like because we're literally out of shit to talk about until Sebastian just thinks something or Matt thinks something. All right. You or, like, I, okay. Iron Man I three. Who the fuck is excited? Oh for that shit. shit. Okay. Well, so what? Iron Man three. Me and, yes. Yes. <laughs> me, and me and Tux. <gasps> me and Tux are going to fucking um. Uh, May first, we're going on Friday night to watch Iron Man one, two, and then at midnight, midnight we're gonna watch three. Are, are they doing a? Uh, Let's just take all this shit and fucking record there. I just got, I just got stiff. 
I'm just saying. <laughs> Iron Man 3. Oh. Oh my god. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Pepper, Have you seen? Pepper is suiting up. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Still okay. Well, let, let me let me talk about actual comic shit. Bot. Let me talk about actual comic shit here and say something cool. Ben Kingsley as the Mandarin, I would not have picked anyone better. Because the character of the Mandarin is, if you guys out there in the audience who read the fucking comics, you know how he is. Ben Kingsley is so, and you know that voice that he does in the trailer, All where he's like, yes. where he's like, no, he's like, no matter what you do, I will kill you. You know, like that voice that really, that wasn't scripted. He just decided to do that. Oh, yeah. In the Dude. middle of fucking trailer, he's like, I'm gonna do that now. i never seen the oh, comic yeah. strip, so I'm like, I, I love the series so far. Comic strip? Comic strip. Oh, make- Sorry, the comic books. It's like what? one long comic strip. Like, <laughs> from page yeah. to page. You never know how it started. It could have just been like a fucking... Well, it started out just one strip and yeah. then they cut it in pieces. It could have just, just been put like it into a book. Exactly. It could have just been microfilm like in a library. Yeah. You don't yeah. know. Well, just, I, I, I it was, it was printed on register tape. Just... Let you me just draw know. all of this on register tape. Sorry, and fucking it'll draw the dirty <laughs> napkin. That's all. Right, let me started. rephrase. I never oh, oh so it's Harry Potter now. <laughs> oh. Yeah, he Dixon. Went. No, honestly, honestly though, not not to get off track, but on the topic of J.K. Rowling, oh, that track. woman, that woman is fucking. I mean, she has so, never met an adjective she doesn't like. No, no, but <laughs> <laughs> no, but the thing is, okay, but the so, thing is, so, so me, you're talking about so it. like all of us, uh, so we're adjectives, we're we're, we're, ad- we're so adjective we verb nouns, dude. <laughs> anyway, so adjective verb. Anyway, so oh, so that woman, and penis. that woman, that woman has donated so much. Before money to charity. You know she lost her billionaire status as to how much money she's donated to charity? Wow. That's good, She though. lost her billionaire status. No, she's no, just like, right? I have like two million dollars up to my name. That's donated now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 It's oh, ridiculous. Lord. She's so fucking great. What rich ass right? person does that these no days? Kidding. No one, but no she's one. so fucking nice. Like, she's no such shit. a great person. Nah. Like, she really is a really cool person. I've heard yeah. she's super nice in person. She's like, really cool and shit. <laughs> anyway, back to comics. She's super cool and you should all go support her. Since Everybody go buy her stuff! Since we're promoting everything. We're promoting <laughs> everything <laughs> that exists, ever. Tux, stop moving the mic. No, put it back. I'm just putting it closer because... God damn it, Tux, you're screwing up my... Tux, you're about as loud you're as screwing up my tech! No, I'm not. Wait, why are you moving closer to you? Uh, because if you look at the voices, fucking, I'm barely picking up. Tux, that's what a compressor is for. <laughs> oh. I am the tech master. Okay. Just let him do we shit. are so editing Then that I out. will remove it. To there, back to where it was. I will remove it to back to <laughs> where it was. There is no Dana. Only I'm sorry. <laughs> but I gotta bring this up. That picture. On no! Just, yes. Shut no. the fuck up. I got it. It's yeah. so beautiful. It, you people at home yeah. have to imagine it. Yeah, just yes. imagine it. Just it's basically, let me describe it for you. It's a picture of a fucking giant mushroom that's like floating in space. And there's a little space station under it. And it's just like the mushroom is trying to consume the space station. But then the planet is exploding in the background, is that and there's you're... a fucking unicorn flying through space, is that and what... it's punching the mushroom, what and there's this about? beautiful Technicolor explosion. Is that what you're getting from it? Then... Welcome back, we're really talking about the background. So oh, deal with oh, it. Is God. that what you're getting out of that? I had yeah. bears and lasers <laughs> with sunglasses, and yeah, okay, it's a Rorschach <laughs> inkblot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So just make make some shit up. You're not wrong. <laughs> you wouldn't be wrong. Regardless of what you say, it's, wrong, it's yeah. your own imagination. Are we, are we are we live streaming your drawings? No. For those okay. of you who don't know, Robert is an artist, so don't ask him to draw you fucking anything, or he'll hunt you down and kill your family. <laughs> Robert has <laughs> Robert has begun to draw. Sure this will translate incredibly well into audio <laughs> and in video. <laughs> okay, we're gonna dictate everything that he's doing. Uh, okay, there's a he's line. There's a paper. line. He's making circles. He's making <laughs> circles <laughs> above the paper. He's, 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 he's writing, paper. "Fuck all of you guys. I hate you. Why are you even in my house?" The lovely, <laughs> the lovely <laughs> penis. Okay, 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 okay. Now it's back to the uh, back to the original topic, and you're all breaking the rules. Nobody here has the fucking talking stick. Well, Nobody gives a shit about talking sticks. No one fucking cares. We're drunk. Okay, so um, back to the original topic. So if you guys, for the audience here, for the audience here, me and Tux are like massive fucking comic book like cinephiles. Right? We're we're starting yeah, to I get found there. that out last week. Well, well, I'm starting to get there. there. We don't drink yeah, beer out for fucking three hours. Yeah, we're we're both like how we both have a fire obsession. Like like we walk into a store. Okay, wait 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 wait. Before we go on with this, Sebastian and I are pretty much the same fucking person, except one's white, one's Mexican. <laughs> and one likes metal and one likes techno, but we'll let you figure out which one's the white one and which Seven one's Mexican. Seb is slightly heavier, Tux is slightly God taller. damn, you're so <clears throat> high, Sebastian. I mean, just, and I'm slightly both more... both have curly-ass <laughs> hair. And, and, and I'm slightly more... And... Slightly? 
Yeah, anyway. <laughs> I'm not I, mean, I don't it, think Sebastian's are. Matt is going on an adventure right now. He's leaving us. He's going on an adventure. He's going on his adventure. I, 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 he's going I to go for his So, so basically, that. basically, um, so <clears throat> him and I dragged Rob around for like four hours last Friday, and we've God. each spent I think almost a hundred dollars in comics. It was a little ridiculous. Like it was, stupid. and we were walking to stores like, oh my god, dude, look at these, look at all these issues of the series. I haven't even started yet, but they have them. Let's buy them. And yeah. he's talking about, like forty issues. I spent like fucking ten dollars on a variant cover of a thing, something I already owned. Just, just like I really want this variant. Oh, cover. way to fucking brag. Fifty dollars on two copies of something I already own. Well, that <laughs> makes you broke and stupid. Doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. Yes, and you wonder why you don't have money for anything. No, so basically, yeah. okay, and I just. Right before I went into work, I spent on a new bike. I don't even fucking own yet. Hey, edit, 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 edit out, edit out, edit out the exact prices so no one thinks that we're rich because we want to do a kickstart. <laughs> we are not rich. We're we're rich. We are not. We, wanna, that's we a are not being paid paycheck. to do I'm this. Not gonna, I'm not going to lie. That's a weak ass paycheck. We are weak. $700. We are weak. We are all weak ass it's paycheck. Weekly. If it's really? weekly, then you're fucking loaded. But that's. Mine's yeah, my okay. Bi weekly. He's splitting rent though, right? <clears throat> so yeah, yeah. So we have okay. Every every other week, I get anywhere from like. Don't talk. About, don't talk about your fucking paycheck. So on the you show. know, I'm like. Don't talk about your paycheck on the podcast. Just say how the much. The IRS you could know. be listening. The IRS could be listening. You fucking get it, and it'll tax you for a podcast. All right, edit all yeah, that shit out. Podcast, <laughs> edit all the fucking speaking about money out. No, anyway, no, 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 so. No, no, no. <laughs> Okay, so back to the original topic. Um, Very spending money. That's what our no. Topic so was. we fucking <clears throat> yeah. like me. Me and Tugs are all the big comic files, but right now, like the huge argument is, who else here like reads or cares about comics at all whatsoever? I do. I read manga. All but right, that's different. All right, are you gay? Who is fucking no, killing it right now? Fan, so. What do you mean killing it? Who's killing it? Who's like doing that. their shit and doing it right? <laughs> and, Fuck There's nothing wrong with Mondo. Yeah. No, thanks to the new 52, I just haven't been really... DC shit right now. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, right now. Go read Marvel. Yeah, go read... Oh, no, no, let's just endorse no, them too. No, Marvel, <laughs> you're the best. We love you. Better you're better endorsed Go read now. either Sandman or Transmetropolitan. Both are both really good. Because that's what I really <clears> I, only, I only read manga because, I, I mean, I love Marvel, I love DC. Because you're a it, fucking weeaboo. Well, Weeaboo. Did you just make a Define the word. You don't know what a weeaboo. Oh, hang on. <laughs> you have to fucking, yeah, you don't even know the word until you have to fucking define it yourself. Weeaboo. Oh, yeah. No, this second half of the weeaboo. podcast is just like so it's it's terribly <laughs> uncoordinated and hard All right. compared to the first. Is We're going to define the word weeaboo here, guys. Weeaboo. Oh, weeaboo. There's no win. Okay, weeaboo. Okay, for those of you who are listening and know what a weeaboo is, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> that means the one so listener out there who wrong. probably doesn't know what a weeaboo is. So. All right. Weeaboo. Someone who is obsessed with, Je- with Japan, Japanese culture, anime, etc., and attempts to act as if they were Japanese, even though they're far from it. They use Japanese Onisha? words. Now you fucked up! Onisha. Now you Onisha. fucked up! Onisha. You have fucked up now! <laughs> now you have fucked up! That's right. At least this motherfucker here. Jesse over here types everything on Facebook as though it was on as though it was 4chan, oh which makes God. me lives this, this makes me live the experience of like I don't even know what my life is. That's I'm just crazy. like I go to Facebook and I'm like, oh man, Facebook! I fucking hate Facebook. Why am I here? Because I've modified my Facebook to like something completely different so I can actually enjoy it. Yeah. Also, <clears> I, I goes for. Yeah. Also, I just fucking I hate people on Facebook. Okay, let's get on let's get on this topic right now. People yeah. on Facebook like. Slack the division, shit. Yay. the shit, no. equalism, post. Yay. the oh, shit, right. no, no, post. slacktivism. Like, hey guys, I'm trying to make a difference in politics. I'm gonna change so, my profile picture. Yeah, yeah. yeah. exactly. And, guys, and you should do the same. <clears throat> when I fuck first, you. No, God damn it. When I first saw that, I was like, okay, I can understand the fact that you're trying to represent equalism, and I'm all for that. But I'm, but changing your profile picture is not. Going to change how how the government thinks. Yeah, no, 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 no. no, 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 no. But, but let's but let us let us get on to the topic. Let's yeah. even more 
fucking offensive than that whole like I, I respect people that are doing the whole equalist thing. That's great. They're is his right. fucking profile pictures? <laughs> not no, I'm, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I love it. No, 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 no. I love it. Oh my god. You know you're so... gonna pop his mic if you keep fucking screaming. Yes. Fuck you. Right. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> back to your subject. I love you. Go. Anyway, yeah, as you were talking about, so... anyway, so there is this. I mean, there's this motherfucker on Facebook profile who goes by the name of X. X, 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 X. Beep. Beep. Anyway, um, <coughs> so the name of this motherfucker, uh... Doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. But this piece of shit, um... He had, instead of instead of having the equalist, you know, Facebook Same thing, time. what he proceeded to do instead was just have, like, a picture of, it's like, a man, of a, a man and a woman standing side by side. Basically saying that, oh, the gays shouldn't have rights to get married because it's offensive and because I'm Christian and because I want to just press my beliefs on the rest of the world. Literally, he was trying to argue with me about why. I was like, I, I literally so, just stopped. So I literally in just stopped. This, in posting this status or picture, he started an argument with you directly. <laughs> That's what you're saying. Yes. Okay. He insulted my views. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh, no, no, shit. No, 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 Internet no. fight. no, no. no, no. <laughs> No, no, but the thing was, the thing was, the thing was, though, is that, it's that, I didn't start a fight with him, I just asked him, dude, can you take that down, that's, like, really offensive, especially because he was, like, he wrote, like, a really long-ass quote, which I don't want to say, because it's extremely fucking offensive, and will also lower your cognitive function that's, by exactly um, so much. That's what's called a tirade. Yeah, a little bit, yeah. Yeah, I know. What was it, uh, You're welcome. I know. You learned English today. I know today. what a tirade yeah, is. You learned English today, you, me- you Spanish-speaking motherfucker. I speak... <laughs> Better English than you! <laughs> you ruined the joke! You didn't even read. Spanish, but you were figuring it out by now. Seven so, no, no, so let me finish my fucking story. So basically... No. They can't tell with the way my voice is fucked up because <laughs> fucking alcohol and I've been yelling. I love you, Spanish. So, so basically... They can tell you or not. So basically, <clears throat> basically, so this guy, I asked him, like, dude, can you, like, change that? That's extremely fucking offensive. Also, you're being a total jackass. Because he's this dude that posts so much, like, shit, like, Obama's, uh, Obama's Satan, like, those people. Yeah. I have him on Facebook profile because he's a cool guy to talk to, but they post that shit, I'm like, dude, take that shit down, it's extremely offensive, and you're being a fucking jackass. So I asked him, I was like, no, because it's the truth, and because it's what God speaks. And I was like, uh, that's not good enough that. Are you fucking yeah. serious, dude? Like, no, it was just... Are we seriously getting into religion on no, 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 I'm oh, talking about this dude who posted this extremely okay. fucking offensive, like, you know the whole equal rights thing that's posted, <clears throat> being posted right now? He posted this we're super religion. We're talking about religion. Talking about rights. Oh, we're talking, oh, yeah, we're talking. We're mostly talking about this jackass. Yeah, this fucking and this. It's just. It's just like. It's just like a basic premise is like people on Facebook are so fucking stupid. <clears throat> like they are yeah. so fucking stupid and like the shit they post, and it's like, do you deliberately have to be a fucking ass? Okay, I'm gonna enlighten your lives right now. Okay, there's a thing me and Tux call. Me and Tux like to go to call Reddit. Uh, and you don't have to go there, but the thing is, I just want you to visit something. You probably shouldn't go there. Don't go there, it'll ruin yeah. your life. R space six what? <laughs> go to a what? subreddit, go to a subreddit called R cringe, and no. just browse through it. And oh, don't my even God, fucking yes. do that. Do it. Yes. Do it. Do it. Seven's Seven's the devil, about. don't do that. I am the devil, but that's besides the point. No, what was oh, it? I saw a post What was it? Um, the, the Japanese instructional yes. video on how to speak <laughs> sexy <laughs> English? That was the oh, best God. thing ever. My uh, my coworker event. and I <laughs> quote that to each other all the fucking time at work. It's so good. She's like, "Do you like this pussy?" I'm like, "The audience can't you, see what you're for, doing." For those of you who can't see, I was furiously nodding my head up and down. Furiously so yes. nodding. Tux likes the Fur- pussy. <laughs> yes, I do. Which is a cat. But anyway, uh, fuck you. <laughs> I'm not making that joke. <laughs> we have a goose. Not going there. We have a goose called I'm Jingles. <laughs> because it doesn't matter. You can't fucking know what animal it is. It's like for all you know, it's a fucking goddamn elephant. Yeah, fucking. So and and all three of them look the exact fucking same. Yeah. <coughs> <laughs> we own three black elephants. <laughs> <laughs> three tiny black elephants. Actually, they're pretty what large. About the sheep. <laughs> Remember that video that about the sheep that just multiplies the multiple things and then they like No cows! Oh, Jesus! Cows! cows. No. <laughs> no, no, no! No, 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 edit this out because no one needs to see this and no one needs to hear but about it. Awesome. We're not drunk enough for that. Even I'm not drunk enough for that yet. 
That okay, so uh, now, now we're going to a topic. So me and Robert, uh, Tux passed out and was therefore not aware of what we were watching. Watch kind it. of, but not really. Cool. Kind um, of. Um, <laughs> really so me and Rob, me and yes, because me and Robert, you know, <laughs> we're kind of chilling there last night, and so we proceeded to browse up. It's like, hey, what can we watch? So we found last this night. You mean like a week ago? Yeah, like a week yeah ago. it was a week ago. <laughs> Thanks for ruining the illusion. <laughs> This isn't a magic act. Yeah, we're talking about it the could fans be. illusion. Yeah. It could be doing magic. Yeah. No, I think the illusion yeah, is know. that we have fans. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're talking to nobody right now. Yes, we're talking to a microphone. <laughs> Thanks, <laughs> microphone, for being our friend. Anyway, um, uh, so, so basically, basically, me and Robert were sitting there, and we're browsing Netflix, and all of a sudden we see this thing called Snuffbox. I was like, oh, this is this British actor that I really like. Let's watch this. Oh. 30 what a minutes, horrible mistake. 30 that minutes later, <laughs> me and Robert are just sitting there contemplating, contemplating our lives. fucking lives and our existence because we just <laughs> didn't know what the fuck we were watching. We are like, this just started out with the dude getting hung and there was this fucking red dot. Goddamn red dot. That goddamn red dot. I, I remember that red dot. That shit was just, oh my God. For those of you who don't know what it is and you have Netflix, look up Snuffbox, watch the first 30 minutes, and it's just... It doesn't matter how high, drunk, sober, whatever <laughs> you are. That show will literally make no sense. <laughs> it will like literally make, make no Batman sense. It's man funny because, because it's so fucking no, true. The that one that fucking made no fucking sense. It, here, this sense. Is a, it was just shit. This is a CP... What, what, what was that name? Was I, I see you and here's your freaking after season. season. Scene. What was that? The after season or whatever? Oh, it was after last season. Okay, this is this horrible movie that Matt made us watch a riff track for called <laughs> After <laughs> Last Season. Season. Look that shit up. Okay, it is so the worst. Was, like, I, was I passed out for this one? Yes, you were. Okay. If no. you can make it, it was through nice. 10 it. minutes of that movie, I swear. Oh, was that the Doctor up. movie? We will, yes. we will, we will send you. We we'll, will send you something oh, if you make it through 10 find minutes. Find me. I will send you okay. money. Okay. This in All right, so if we if we ever get a link for it on the fucking YouTube thing. Yeah, okay. When we upload this, we'll put oh, links to all the shit we're referencing, yeah. blah, blah. But I, I remember this. I do remember this now. Oh, my God. That was like a fucking like, pre-K school <laughs> class budget. No, it's like I, I tell people, for a mo- if you look at IMDb, this movie supposedly has a budget of $6 million. What? No, I shit you not. What did they spend it on? It's a pro- it has Cardboard. to be... Cardboard. It ha- yeah, cardboard and butcher paper. And paint. It has to be a producer's, like... Best Nightmare. scam. Because people who have stood in the back of an elementary school gymnasium filming a ch- fourth grade <laughs> dramatics production with the lens cap on have inadvertently <laughs> made better movies than this. <laughs> it's it's the worst thing you'll ever see. I, I can't get into this. There's terrible. literally not it's a worse. single moment you can point to. There's a movie enjoy. out there called Birdemic Shock and Terror. <laughs> if you know what this is, watch it. We will post a link to the John Tron review of this because we love this. It's a hundred times better. It's just like, Birdemic is such a terrible fucking movie. And then when we say that after last season, literally, we'll give you cancer. <laughs> <laughs> we are not joking. <laughs> so please, take this seriously. We're there is cancerous threat if you try to watch this. And we've you all watched it. We've all watched bits and pieces. We're all gonna die very we've soon. We've all tried to yeah. watch it. I think I have we eight want, brain tumors. We had to skip their parts just to say, okay, are we done with this yet? <laughs> I found the damn thing, and I still <laughs> never watched more than fifteen minutes consecutively. You have and a brain tumor. Right? My nothing. brain is a tumor. <laughs> oh my god. It's, so uh, on to on to Mr. Topic. Let's let's get let's get let's get a little serious here. Uh, not really, but um, Dead Space. Oh, no, well, actually, no, Dead Space 2 was a good game, but uh, play Dead that. Did you play that? Okay, you had the third one. Dead Space yeah, was not a good game. Dead Space was. Dead Space fucking curb stomped survival horror as a yeah, genre. but it was good. It's, just, it's actually a good it. story. It's got a good story. It was different. Right? I, I, I don't know what. The thing is, I, I love the Silent Hill series, but uh, to a certain point. Because, well, yeah. But like, hey, hey, hey. Silent Hill Homecoming. Yes. Uh, <laughs> Let's Jason! 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 That was rain. That was heavy rain. No, that's also the name of your fucking brother. <laughs> oh, is it? Is it? Jason. Oh, because uh, I never actually played. So there's like, I, this is a video I'm trying to find it. It's a, it's, it's a Silent Hill and Re- Heavy Rain back to back. How the Jason counter? <laughs> it's the Jason. You're like counter. running after. No, the worst, part about, the worst part about the worst part about Homecoming is the fact that he has no reason to be there. All he has to do is fucking leave. That's all that's, he has to that's do. Not, that's that's have you seen the alternate but... ending where they where it's just aliens and they get abducted yes. by aliens? That's all. They, they, they always have an aliens ending in all Silent Hills, just for I guess 
show. Shock value? Yeah, shock value. Yeah, because well, Americans. Yes. So anyway, on, on to the concert. So the other day, so the other day, me, me, me and Tux, me and Tux were talking about like, uh, like weird theories and shit like that. And uh, and so this is a few weeks ago. Um, but uh, but the other day, the other day I was talking to the fr- some friends of mine, and we came up with the concept of you guys were talking about Aladdin earlier, and this this it came in right now. Have you guys heard of the fucking Aladdin theory? The Aladdin theory. The Aladdin theory is fucking weird. So basically, like, the thing is that supposedly Aladdin takes place in like a post-apocalyptic world, like. 50,000 years in the future. Oh, yeah, 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 because, yeah, 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 because no, like, no, because, like, apparently, it. apparently whenever, like, the genie leaves the bottle and he sees Aladdin, he's like, wow, your clothes are so third century. But he's been in the bottle for, like, 10,000 years, so he wouldn't have, you know, been around to see the I third century. So, long, so it's know. like, it's you know, he, mu- he must have been locked <laughs> after the third century. That's fucking so it's pedantic. Like, it's it's no no and it's weird because like pe- people have seen and it was it was uh, I'll post the game there there's a video where a game grumps are playing the fucking Aladdin game yes I'm watching and, um, that now. and oh, they're um, no, I'm it, yeah. and uh, and they see like a stop sign and it's called like holy fuck dude the Aladdin theory is real what the fuck thanks man in the middle of fucking podcast <laughs> thanks man is, is it your mom calling I muted mom you know it's Monday <laughs> anyway edit that out I muted it behind you bastard uh so anyway back to the thing so there's all these. Like, apparently every One fucking... more. Wait, wait, wait. Let me try wait to do something it. important. Wait for it. Oh. What the fuck? Anyway, anyway. Go. So anyway, no. every fucking... Apparently every Disney movie has, like, a weird-ass fucking theory behind it. Like, there's the one that, uh... There's the one that the, the, little, the little Mermaid one's fucking weird, There though. it goes. Like, have you guys heard the Little Mermaid one? What was that one? The one that... Ariel's just a schizophrenic, and what is it? Fucking uh, Flounder and Sebastian are just the voices inside her head that tell her that she should stay. <laughs> that she should stay under the sea because that's it's safe. It's safer inside of her mind, and not to go out of the sea because that's the real world and it's fucked up. People will judge her and hate her for what she is. Which is real is that like the Rugrats thing where Angelica just like God that whatever. fucking oh, yeah, the theory. theory? Oh, like these fan theories. It's like I was talking to my friends like, why the fuck do people create this shit? I'm like, people are fucking crazy. Hey, it's all started with dead, dead trees, man. <laughs> no, what? Okay. okay. If you ever go on TV tropes, there's a there's a uh, thing called epileptic trees, and it's all just the most fucking bizarre, outlandish fan theories you can imagine. Is it like a show? No, no. It's a, it's the uh, trope. The okay. trope is called epileptic trees because someone originally that was their explanation for Lost because some of the trees suffered epileptic fits. And it made more sense than anyone, anything anyone Stand else had come up smoke. with. <laughs> <laughs> and so that was, and so that became the that name was, for your most yeah. tin foil okay. hat wearing theory. Yeah, you no, come but up with. but the Rugrats theory is kind of fucked up. The rubber, you know, it's you know so the theory, dark. Right? That that is, it's, really it's fucking dark. dark. That is the most epileptic of trees. That is, that is yeah, that is a dark, dark yeah, fucking. No, but still, I mean, like, there's some fanfics out there. Like, especially a lot of cartoons have really fucked up, like. Oh, you hear about the Ed and Eddie one where they're all trapped? Oh yeah, where they're all oh. trapped in purgatory, and that's like literally what it is. What yeah. is it? That all the kids in Ed and Eddie, because their parents are never around, it's that they're all like trapped in purgatory, yeah, exactly. and that's why they never leave the cold. That's why they always there. No, Ed and Eddie. Oh, that was the concept that they're all trying to purgatory. Yeah. I've never heard the Hey Arnold theory. I don't know what that is. I don't know. I don't think there is one. I, yeah, there is. I know there is. There's one for fucking everything. Like the Pokemon no, one is the concept that you don't see it. I don't think like you see the family at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah you do. You see them constantly. Yeah, I don't, I don't yeah but the I don't Pokemon one. one the Pokemon one, one is that like Ash is in a coma and like uh, in a fetish somewhere. <laughs> no, 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 no. Listen. So basically, like you know how like he's riding his bike and he crashes right at the very very beginning of the series. Vaguely, uh, like at the very, very first I episode, like I, w- I went, I went back and watched, and it's true. He crash lands his bike, and then he wakes up, and he's like in the hospital, and he's like, "Oh, I woke up," and then he gets Pikachu and fucking leaves and shit. The theory is that when he crashes, he's in a coma. That he just stays in a coma. That's it. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's it. Right. And then the rest of it's just like his fucking imagination. And that's why he's always the same age. That's why he never okay fucking changes. So that's why he's always they, ten. So, so they, like every so cartoon happens. ever. Yeah. So no, but also the theory. There's actually a pretty legit theory about Pokemon that, like, I guess, like the fucking Pokemon. What is that big flying fuck thing? Ho or whatever. Sure. Ho, right? Yeah. Ho hos. Okay. Ho ho ho. The Santa Claus Pokemon. Go buy some ho hos. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're dead because Twinkie's dead, dude. Hostess gone probably forever. Probably yeah. No. No. We're not gonna get into those. So we're, not, we're not gonna fucking get into those. Those are just stupid and dumb and not even fucking. So those are all. There's probably. A yeah, but those are dumb. shitty and dumb. Well, yeah. Okay, those are shitty and just badly written. Every single one starts off with like, we're gonna blank out the name here, but
That's fucking every fucking theory about that theory. Yeah, we're gonna edit that whole thing. Oh my god! Let's edit that whole thing. That whole thing, Britain. Edit that out. That can never be shown. That can never be shown. That just needs to go away. Oh my god! Just edit the name out because they won't know who I'm talking about. No, don't edit the name. Edit the whole fucking thing. I'm just glad someone sober can be editing this. That's why Brent did what I did. So, um, yeah, anyway, but, anyway. But, like, seriously, like, if you look at the, the, the theories regarding the, the beginning of the series and blah, blah, have you ever met the fucking fandom and how fucking autistic we are yeah, as a whole? Well, weird. yeah, that's why present, I said there's no Okay, present, talk. present company excluded. Excluded? Yeah, uh, we're not autistic. I'm a fucking no. fanfic writer. That's <laughs> pretty messed up theory. Okay, but anyway, anyway. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry, do you remember the one I pitched you? <laughs> what? You remember the one I pitched you? No. You fucking oh. Edit this whole section out. I didn't out. think that was a fan theory. I thought that was just a edit, fucked up idea. Edit this whole section out. This never needs to be heard. We got so sidetracked right Someone now. Else did that. Someone else did a comic about, about that. Everything. Oh, really? Yeah. That's pretty yeah, put that in your mouth, Steven. Like. No, I'm just fucking with you. <laughs> no, but like, I don't like talking about fan theories for a fandom because they're fucking of course, not. We were just talking about them the past ten I know, minutes. Right? No, I know. I'm talking about no, for our theory. yeah for, for our, our for fandom. our fan. They are shit. Oh, okay. They are bad. <coughs> and they're just terribly written. God damn it! <laughs> happened because some of the trees have epileptic fits. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> anyway, no. But back back to like back to like real fan theories. Like, okay, back I mean, to we were basically talking about the Aladdin thing where when they're talking about Game Grumps. They, I was watching that and I was like, what the? F-? I first saw that. I was like, the Aladdin what the theory sign? is fucking weird because like it it genuinely adds up because the thing is that like. Disney has a lot of fucked up shit in their movies. Well, yeah, like, that's a lot why of they have really little... dark fucking Dude, themes the, in their movies the that you like, don't realize until you're older. That's why they, over the history, you see all those yeah, uh, like, subliminal like messages Be- that they have. All yeah, and, and Beauty and the Beast is basically Stockholm Syndrome, the movie. Yeah, yeah it's but... because they steal everything from fucking Grimm Brothers and Hans yeah. Christian Anderson, and they're just some messed up writers. Yeah, yep. And don't even. But don't, they don't, don't they put it even in there. get me started on the fucking Little Mermaid because that's all the worst well, movies that's of all they time. They put it in there just to see if people do it. But honestly, I, you know, honestly, some people probably just overreact on it. They can say, "Oh, well, oh, like the Little Mermaid picture." You see the freaking you know dildo in the front. No, no, the thing, no I think people are mad. I know, but I'm just saying. In general, yeah, I'm just, what the fuck are you even talking about? <laughs> You've never heard that. Jesus, no, 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 let's go. No, 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 there's a subliminal message. No, what is it? Subliminal. Subliminal, and it's called. Called. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, okay. No, no, all right. No, no, no. no. Let me let me hear the voice Sebastian doesn't Wait, know what I'm talking about. The the word you're sorry. The phrase you're looking for is subliminal insert. Okay, that. Okay, there you go. Because <laughs> anyway. we're talking about dildos. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it was. Anyway, like I was practically ah. saying, if you look at the front it. page of an actual <laughs> the front photo of the. <laughs> what? On the title page. On the picture of the title page. On the front yes. cover. On, on the, the front cover. On the cover. Yes, on yeah. the front cover, it actually shows the uh, the palace. And there is an image that actually looks like a penis. It's unbelievably phallic. Yes. <coughs> I think people miss it. Wait, okay. Let, let, me, let, me, let, me, let me ask something. Is it unbelievably phallic like the new fucking Tenacious is, album no. cover? It's actually something that you... <laughs> Rise of the Phoenix. If you guys no. have not seen this. It is really actually I mean, something wait, 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 wait. Really It's, act, it's, it's very penis. Okay, let's look it yeah. up. Let's you can look it at it, but it's like it's really easy to miss because it's like, oh, whatever. It's just the palace in front of the, on the front cover. See, what they fucking do. But I don't give a shit about that. That's Go to the sun. I think that's yeah, it. Yeah, that's uh, that's it right there. All I care about is, is the fact that it's the See? worst fucking message in history. Oh my god! See, but thing, oh oh my god! A dick! Yes, that's a dick. Thing. Y'all seriously never knew about that? That is a yes. dick on this movie. That is a dick. Yeah, but yeah. Kind of, that's why people oh, look oh, at. Oh wait, 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 That's wait, the wait, sex dungeon wait, in the wait, palace. And, <laughs> and, okay, um, dungeon. It's in the fucking. There's a there's another movie where the secret There's the Lion King where they actually have the words. No, it fucking doesn't. 
Okay, they, people no, 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 wait, 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 wait. Yeah, I think it, um, I think it's Little Mermaid, but there's another one. There's the little res- the rescuers the that the they boner. do that where they actually With have the priest like a, boner. The priest the boner. The priest boner. The priest boner. The priest boner. In, in the Little Mermaid. I don't know yeah. saw that one. The, priest, the okay. priest boner. Look that shit up too. What's the Little <laughs> Mermaid <laughs> priest boner. And pray that nobody looks at your browser history. That's what a racing is for. It's okay. Anyway, no, back, back to actual theories, though. The fucking, uh, <laughs> I don't know why. Wait, wait, there really is a priest phone right now? Yeah, okay, go to the, go to the second He's one. Got it. Yeah, it's a bit. Like, <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> wow. What is my life right now? I will never look at my childhood the same. <laughs> they had to edit that shit out. Look at that. Yeah, they edit. Oh the same God. way they put fucking Brent, pants don't on edit, Don't edit this it. conversation. They're yeah. just saying they had to. They had to do the same thing. There was one in the rescuers where they were riding down the, um, I guess the anchovy um, uh, cart thing. And while they're riding down, they um, apparently had an image where there was a naked woman that's like flashing the screen. <coughs> I remember hearing about that. What the fuck is that? A uh, pussy. A pussy? I guess, the, I guess, the, I guess the, the triangular Oh, uh, image because it's the Jesus fish in it, and the Jesus fish is a vagina. Oh, yeah. Kind of looks like it. No, the, the other fuck? one where... Oh, oh yeah, you're right. right, right I've never seen that. I think that one's... Uh, the uh, other uh, one that I've seen where... Uh, which is right there, the... Um, the the um, Lion King one? Yeah. Where yeah, they yeah. actually say that the, uh, in the clouds, uh, while... Uh, what's his name? <coughs> laying on the ground, laying on the actual top of the mountain, the word S- spelled S- out is sex. X. It yeah. fucking Sex. isn't though. But the thing, yeah, I don't know if it is or it's not. I think people are just basically looking at the images of everything just to find something, just to point fingers and blame on Disney. That okay, okay, okay. That was no, their no. actual production. That was their same one thing. Of their same thing. Okay. Well, on well, well, okay. Well, let, let's get on the topic of Dick. Oh shit! That's also that that was the one he was talking about. Yeah. What is there? The on the rescuers. I believe that's the name of it. There's yeah. an image yeah. while they're riding on the, the, the um, I fuck what they call it, the anchovy cart thing. Sardine? Is, is sardine? It says sardines on okay. the picture. I, don't, I never watched the movie. So anyway, if you look in the background there, there is an image of a woman flashing the screen. But while uh, the, while the like video is playing, it's so, are, it goes oh, so yeah. fast. Those are some titties. Yes, if yeah. it goes so fast, you cannot see it unless you freeze frame each like millisecond on the frame on the actual video the to fuck, see it. Disney, why are you so obsessed with sex? Was, was Walt Disney like... <laughs> what? That's what? Just, that's just... Wow. That's a stretch. That's just that's bullshit. That's a stretch. That's a little bit of a stretch. That's right bullshit. There. Okay, well, on, on to... It's <laughs> funny as hell. <laughs> on, to, on to actual... On to actual... <laughs> Okay, edit shit, that though. out, rule number one. Thou shalt not talk shit about the Lion King. That's creative, though. That is creative. I'll eat you with a fork. <laughs> Whoa! Uh, oh. Out. So, are, no. are, okay. are you going to toss my salad, too? No. Are you going to toss that salad for me? Oh, no. Yeah. I'm going in with a knife. Okay, okay how about this? Okay, okay, okay. Off the Look. subject. Off the subject, I'm going to ask you guys. Have you guys actually gone to see the new uh, The Great Power Boss? Uh, not yet. No, but I was I was about I was about to talk about that, so okay. let me do that shit. <laughs> So here's the thing. Fuck you, you don't run this podcast. We all do. No. Aren't you just a bitch? <laughs> Such a cross <laughs> kidding, baby. You want to fight words? Fight me in real life. All right, get back to the subject. Wait, the one over here right now. <laughs> you take it outside, guys. <laughs> is this real life? Okay, well, anyway. what is? What are you talking about? Uh, that's something I didn't need to see. Anyway, <laughs> talked about what you were talking Why? about. Uh, Why on the about? internet? Searching for so anyway, the great power okay. <laughs> okay, so anyway, anyway, here's the thing. So let's talk about fan theory. So when the great, so when the fucking actual the original Wizard of Oz came out, uh, and then Wicked came out, I had somebody explain Wicked to me the other day. I never read the books. So <clears> no, it's so. fucking it's trippy, good. dude. I heard it's it's trippy as balls, and apparently yeah, the Wizard of Oz is just Dorothy and them are all the fucking bad guys, pretty much. Yeah, and well, they're yeah. killing the last rebellion leader <laughs> of the entire thing because apparently Oz is just a fucking tyrant. That is taking over the land and is trying to kill all the royalty oh, so yeah. he can rule it. So I, I read that I was like, what the fuck? This is apparently like an actual like fan theory that's real. Apparently I was like, what the, the fuck is my life? The, no, the book is messed up anyway because it's not, I mean, it's like half, half of it is this incredibly like moralist undertone where in the beginning of the story, the people of Oz are just getting fucked up by these just messed up like puppet sex shows. That, like, everyone's, like, fucking quitting their jobs so they can go watch them and shit like that. And everything's falling apart and Oz is taking over and shit like that. And then the other half is just this incredibly objectionist fucking Ayn Rand shit with the, where, uh, Elphaba fights against Oz. 
It's this is it's, all wicked, right? Yeah, okay. it's completely yeah, it's, fucking schizophrenic. Yeah, it's crazy as fuck. It's like, completely messed up. But uh, I know. I mean, honestly, like last Panther. Before we just skip on uh, another topic, though, um, you don't fucking own us. <laughs> No, but we want to get it. We're moving this along. I like how scripted Sebastian t- wants this to be. No, I know. Of tyrants, it's it's not the <laughs> I, I have a set. I'm like a Kira, dude. I just fucking blow up Neo Tokyo. This is all mine now. I was only great asking. Tokyo Empire. You're only allowed because I say so. I was, exactly only, I was only asking, like, has anybody else seen it? Yeah. I haven't seen it yet. What is okay. it about? My wife just said it. It's. My wife just saw it. She just texted me. It's a good movie. But like, get her in here. We'll talk about that shit. Story of Oz, basically the story of Oz. I heard that a lot of people were mad at it because it fucked up the whole Wicked thing, and it just made it like. I I don't I'm know. Sure I can't relate did. to it, so I, I never it saw the book. Fucked up. I'm I'm sure it. It. I never read the book, yeah. so I don't know. That's the thing <clears> about like, Wicked is probably second, just about only to. Well, that's the problem. Fans, as far as people who you do not mess with their story. Well, yeah, that's they what are, every fandom. You don't do that. Oh, I mean, like as far as musicals go, yeah, Wicked fans are rabid. Well, yeah, like of the opera, like, they like the I, 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 they are uh, Wizard of Oz. They do the same thing, but no, um, uh, there are multiple ones. I really, the only thing, my, the only thing my wife had to say about it was that it was good, but it was incredibly Disney. Yeah, the it was. whole movie is just. Believe! So there's a lot of priest boners. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Phallus <laughs> objects hidden around oh, the no, movie. No, no, no. Yeah, because Phallic symbol. Because Phallic symbol. Phallic symbol. The, Phallic. I think they could have picked a better Wicked Witch of the West character. I mean, at first she was really good, and, I was, and then when she actually gets converted and changed to the Wicked, West, oh, sorry, Wicked Witch of the West, <clears throat> yes, I was like, convert her. no, this character is not <laughs> perfect for the, character, for the role. I want to be a Loompa Loompa. Yeah, because Oz needs help being fucked up. But I like how they, at the at the end, and this is a spoiler, a little bit, uh, how they actually make it so it kind of relates to what happens in The Wizard of Oz, the ori- the old, uh, you know, black, white, you know, I don't know. I was and we was in color. Yeah, yeah dude, that was color. That's the I'm first I have the color. comic book. That's it was in color. Why do you think I'm correcting myself? Like, black and white slash black color. Yeah, there's a comic book. Marvel and DC work together on a fucking Wizard of Oz comic book. I'm talking about the I original have that movie. Shit. I'm talking about the uh, I'm talking about the original Dorothy. Keep doing Mama. that. It it'll help the disbelief. I hope that's not <laughs> recorded in that. I'm hitting myself with a thunder. It's in there somewhere. What? You know, what is the, the, the recording? The, 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 of what of me hitting myself? Yes. yes. <laughs> I only hear that. It's loud. Stop well, fucking you can see. Anyway, I can we're see it. That out. Cutting you off, damn it! <laughs> <laughs> you don't get to look at the laptop no ma- anymore. No mas. No mas. But you understand? No mas. No, no mas. Give it back, Freddy! Give it back! <laughs> so anyway, anyway, I back, heard this. Dad. Back, 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 back to, back to anyway, like the thing. Um, I think one of the other crazy ass fan theories you've ever heard of um, has to probably be the the Inception one. Have you ever guys ever heard of the Inception one? I've heard no, most of them. but I'm it's sure all in their dreams. No, no, no. The Inception one that you know when he's like looking for the dude that can create the serum that'll keep them under the entire plane ride. Uh-huh. Yeah, that he he gets it. And you know how he tests it, right? And supposedly the minute that he tests it, that's when the movie stops being real. And that's, that's like, at that point is, like, when everything is just a dream until then. And at the end of the movie, he wakes up after testing the ceremony. He's like, oh, shit, I didn't go through with any of this. I honestly fell asleep through that movie. I don't know why. I just could not watch it. It's too intelligent it's, for you. It is. <laughs> yeah, probably. Get okay. out of here, Tommy. Honest, honest. Okay, <laughs> fucking, been really dude, fucking real movie, talk. So. That, is a, that is one of the smartest movies I've ever oh, yeah. seen. Oh yeah, I don't get why Brenton hates that movie. No, I don't the get why best, he hates it. He hates everything that everyone else likes. Really, it's just him. Because no, no. he's a fucking hipster. When I watched, these are hipsters. When I watched <laughs> we it, love you, Brenton. When I watched it, I <laughs> liked it. it. When I went home, I loved it. When I started reading stuff about it and interviews with the directors and shit like that, I fucking loved it. Because what it is, it's a metaphor for filmmaking itself. Yeah. Oh God. Oh it's God. Brilliant. God. Speaking of another metaphor for filmmaking, have you seen Cabin in the Woods? No. Uh, that that yeah, movie yeah, yeah. that movie is a huge metaphor for the horror genre. Basically, the movie is about it's about these kids that go to the fucking you know like to this cabin in the woods that's like supposedly owned by this father, and they just they go to the basement and they pick an item and whatever item it is, someone's a monster that's gonna kill them at the end. So what happens it's is it's, 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 it's all it's all it's all it's all run by this <clears throat> by this evil organization that are trying yeah, to please the old <laughs> that, that are trying to please the gods. By by sacrificing them. So basically, <laughs> evil god of war. So basically, 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 the way that it works is that the company is the film producers. 
the the gods oh are God. the audience, and they're displeased with this. The concept fucking displeased it with everybody has at the horror genre house potentially just downed itself into shit. And it's like it's so funny because it's just that's literally it's just a huge metaphor for that. Evil silent god of dead hill wars. Lord of Lord of Shadows. Yeah. <laughs> Lord of, Lord Lords of Shadows. of Shadows. The fucking worst Castlevania game ever. Every just fucking. Sucks. I want to say it was the worst. It's got, I'm sorry. it's got competition. I'm not saying it's the worst. 64. <laughs> yeah. That it's was got actually, competition. I don't know. Oh, I was about to. Oh, let's replace that. What Castlevania I... Judgment. The fighter that came out. Uh, oh, oh, my God. God. <laughs> I watched Game Grumps play that. I was like, wow, this is really dick. bad. It was like, it was basically that going back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. I was like, this is a game not a fight answer, game. dude. Need yes, we say more? A game of cancer. Oh. Like cancer. Oh, no, what was it? I was going to say, like, the Simon's Quest, the second one. I was like, I've had to play that, and I was like, this is... Hey, 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 hey. Let's not talk about Simon's Quest. Okay. okay. E.T. New, new topic right here. First, worst game that you have physically played. E.T. No, I've I've literally played <laughs> for the Atari. Dude, <laughs> you haven't fucking no, played I've, that. No, Jump I've through not. two thousand bits to collect five cell phone pieces. Worst game ever. <laughs> Best game, game ever. ever. The worst game that you personally have actually oh, played. That oh, that is a, that's a um, hard one. Duke oh. Nukem Forever. Yeah, it takes oh. that's pretty good. Owned or just played? <clears throat> just played. The worst game that you have physically played with your own hands. If Dragon Super Wars had a video four. game, it would be that, but it doesn't. So no shit, right? that one's a really tough um, one. Let's me. let's find like, it would be awesome. Awesome. Yeah. Uh, Duke Nukem Forever. They were like, "Oh my god, it's gonna be the greatest game ever!" And I no, I hated how they tried to polish that to the point where it's saying this is gonna. Be it was an nice. extremely <laughs> polished shit. It's like if you took a piece of shit they and tried. some guy just got a buffer and it was just like, yeah, that's what they tried on to that do. Piece of shit. But it just went like Mythbusters did it. Yeah, Mythbusters, Mythbusters did it. Yeah, They've so actually right. polished your turd to the fact to the point where it was yeah, like you can do that. Shiny, it will hold shiny. A reflection. Yeah. Yep. Okay, but um, <laughs> so that took him forever. That's how they tested that that game didn't really exist to get buffer that game to the point where you can see your smile. Okay, but okay, so. Um, my buddy who um, oh, worst game who ever. loves hard, the Duke Nukem series uh, is like, oh my so god, it's a good game. game. And I play it. Denial, are you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Really? Okay. Oh so god. I play it. I'm like, it was a fucking chore. I had to force myself to finish it. So I. It was get, so insane so and stupid. Yeah. I was like, I had to finish it. I had to. I had to force myself to finish it so I could get my money's worth on the rental. And I talked to my buddy, and he's like, oh, it was good. And, uh, like, three days later, I talked to his brother, and his brother said that he had the exact same opinion. Opinion. Fuck. And I was like, you lying sack of shit? He's like, no, I never said that. I'm like, fuck you. That game was shit. Your opinion is shit on this game. Fuck you. Fuck this game. Stop being and that's the story of like Duke and Forever's ultimate shit. It is horrible. It's such a yeah, it's such an infantilely terrible produced well, yeah, game. Let's let's re- let's, let's re- question the actual po- the question here. What is the most frustrating game? No, I still want to answer the question: the most shitty game I've ever played. Well, I still we want to answer that, did. and then we'll jump. No, because I still don't fucking answer. Jesse, what's yours? Fine. Superman sixty four. Oh! <laughs> oh! Played that shit as a oh! kid. Oh! Yeah, oh! Yeah, 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 Glover 64. No, fuck you. He oh, wins. What game? Glover 64. He wins. Superman 64 is oh shit. Yeah, like a okay, shit. Um, that's, I, I have not played I'm not gonna many lie. games. Really. I'm not going to lie. The shittiest game I've played most recently, because I tend to stay away from terrible games. Yeah. I don't play them. But the shittiest game I've recently played that pissed me off beyond all reason was fucking Aliens Colonial Marines. Was, that was the largest hunk of shit I have ever played in my entire life. Oh, because know. you know what the best part about it was? They charged you sixty dollars for a game that wasn't even finished. No, there was a point where like one of the textures was just like an untextured like model. It was just it was just gray. Really? I was like, what? Yes. Wow. What is this? And they just they reused every sound bite. It was so bad. It was just so fucking bad. It was just a terrible, yeah. shitty fucking game. I never played yeah. it. And you know what the best one was? There are people that, they made a fucking season pass for that. What is the DLC? Okay, so we're releasing the finished game now. <laughs> That's the only DLC. <laughs> I 
DLC patch. That's how games that's how are like, now. They, they, they release now. crap and they have to patch it instantly <laughs> yeah. to make it playable. Fuck you, EA. That sounds exactly. like right there. Fucking destroyer of games. No, 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 no. You know, you know, Electronic no, no. Arts made that okay, shit. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to blow your guys' mind. I was trying to find Actually, that wasn't really. I don't think it's really all EA. Yes. I think it was all. Well, okay, who really. Uh, is EA completely run Origin? By the way, hi, Nathan. Welcome what? to the podcast. Does EA run Say hi. Origin completely? Hey. Or does Origin have their own? Have their own <laughs> okay, okay. Let me explain to you, EA. As somebody that actually knows the fucking history is better than talking to people company and shit like that. It is bullshit because there. I, 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 I work in the game company I will, right now. I have to stay in the office. Hey, yeah, hey, shit, right? your tech support. You don't fucking develop. It doesn't. Mean- I studied development. You dumbass. <laughs> I know everything. <laughs> I currently work in the industry. I gave oh every company since like 1952. I took, there were not in 1952. <laughs> I took physics in college. Why are you, sir, not mailing me a paycheck? <laughs> Damn it, Menso, where are you when I need you? All right, go back to what you're no, saying. No, 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 I, I'm just fucking with you. No, but honestly, though, honestly, though, um, I have talked to some of the EA developers. Like, I went, I went on a field trip I'm there sorry. one time, and I actually, yeah, I know. No, they're really nice people. Just about that, they're really nice people. But they, they, they can't. They, like, off the record, they say so much bad shit about that company and how fucking bullshit it is. Because the thing about EA oh, is, yeah. I'll try to find this poster. Uh, it's oh, this picture I have. It's this picture I have of it's like it's like a picture and it's like chronologically every single company EA has destroyed. I want to take a wild guess how what the number of companies is on there. 50. 50. 50. 32. Six. God damn, wait a minute. He's really close. It's actually about 37. I'm closest without going over. What do I win? Nothing. Uh, new oh, new car. <laughs> I, I already had one. I gave it to you. You win the EA fun. badge holder. Oh, you <laughs> win the EA badge holder. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a hammer and I'll fix that real He was quick. trying to get rid of that shit all the yeah, yeah, last But, I mean, seriously, you go back, EA fucking pretty much invented the yearly release game. Well, yeah, no, the yeah, reason why, I, really I think, I think the reason And when, that's when everything started going yeah. to shit, because companies realized, holy crap, oh, yeah. we can release a game on a time I'm a, I'm instead a, of... I, I, I can explain no, no, no. that. I don't can you, explain that. Don't you fucking no, I don't want to no. explain it, but I'm just saying, I think, honestly, I the, the when EA started going downhill... Is when they actually started saying, okay, you need a, uh, what is it, a, a, a guest pass? Not a guest season pass. pass. Season no, 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 not season pass. Uh, you need an online pass. pass. An online, online, online pass. No, 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 no. I think that you know, because when they made it so, like, if you want to buy the game used, EA is not making any, pro- pro- any money from it, and they're like, fuck you, you're not going to make any money from it, we're not going to let you play this no, game. No, 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 EA went downhill way the fuck before yeah, that. Yeah, dude. Really? I mean, the, fucking the, 1995. The yeah. Really, at the latest. The, the first time they released a sports game is when they went down yeah. at it. Yeah. Or <laughs> because, when, they, uh, when they absorbed Maxis, I think. Yes, yeah, that's when they went they, down. And they, well, the thing, they... When, I will always hate them for taking out Sierra, though. I will always hate them for taking oh, out Sierra. Yes, oh, no, yeah. Sierra was bad. When they Wait, fucking... I thought Sierra just went down on its own. No, when they sword. fucking absorbed... Uh, was it Origin Systems who did Ultima? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. When that was that was pretty much the start point. But when they started getting into sports games, they realized, oh, we can release games on a timeline instead of to a quality and still make money." Oh yeah. We're just oh, gonna we're just yeah. gonna retouch up okay. our graphics of just like no, 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 here, 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 exactly. here's the genius behind it. Genius behind it. EA realized something that most other industries have been doing for so fucking long, but they realized, "Hey, we can mass produce this with video games." What they did is, it's, it's so dumbed down. If any of you fucking play Modern Warfare, I am deeply sorry for you, because you technically kind of and don't if, have an intellectual factor. Yeah, and it is, you're literally buying Warfare, the same I fucking game over and over again. I can promise you that, yeah, okay. because... Are you saying Modern Warfare or just Call of Duty? In all of Call of Duty in okay, general, it's no. the same fucking engine. They yeah. haven't changed that engine in, what is it, about... Almost 15 years. Except yeah. for They haven't Bill. changed that fuck pretty much. Battle, we're not talking Battle? about Battlefield. I know. But we're not like, talking about Battlefield. Battle. Battle. Battlefield's Battle. actually a good military shooter. There you go. It's That's actually it. a good fucking game. It's fun and also it's so glitchy and terrible and fucking fantastic. <laughs> hey man, I'm just going to drive this motorcycle like C4. And it just explodes in there and I kill That's a plane. The part and I game. kill a plane. I don't even know what the fuck happened. I'm, I'm going to have to have a car. I'm going to fucking truck and drive it. No, fucking. But they'll get back to your saying. Battlefield Call is Duty. like that kid. So you Call of Duty make is like anything. Call of okay. Duty is like the EA sport games. It's the same. No, no, shit, but, but, but here, no, 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 but, but here, so here's the okay. genius behind it. Here's the genius behind it. The thing is, oh. the thing is that they made Call of Duty good because they did something. They perfected a multiplayer formula yes, that was so simplistic <laughs> and fucking genuinely retarded. That it, it became massively popular because not 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 to offend anybody, but the human mind has a capacity of pretty much like. The generations now have like the attention of a fucking goldfish. So I wasn't paying attention. You need, yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Thanks for my point. So anyway, 
like the thing is they perfected that by creating such a simplistic like multiplayer formula that it, they can basically just repeat it every year without changing anything. Oh yeah, great. And so the thing is, the thing it's is, like the fucking Madden game. Yeah, no, no, yeah, no, 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 no. But here, here is the glory of it. Here is the glory of it. People don't realize this. They charge you fifteen dollars a fucking map pack. Yeah, two maps. For fifteen dollars Call of Duty. For Call of Duty, and now it's jumped up to twenty dollars. Well, that's why they're doing. Okay, they're doing and, they re- and they release like four maps. No, it's three for twenty dollars. Uh, no, 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 no. Four map packs. Yeah. Well, so that's why they in order release. in order to buy all the map packs, you're spending more than you spend on the yeah. Fucking but but game. here's here's the glory of it. Though. Here's the glory of it. You end up needing the map packs to play the game. Yep. Yeah. Not all of it. Yes. No. Well, no. Yes. The majority of, of the maps that are all being used is all from the like. Okay, the new maps come out. Everyone goes to the new maps. No one wants to play them. Same thing happened with Battlefield because I personally played Battlefield of when it first released, and then they did their Battlefield Premium, and I bought the Premium, and then I realized when all the Premium new stuff came out, mm-hmm. no one went to the original maps, and it was like. I hate these new maps. I want to go back to the original maps. I like the original maps. I was really good because with because they perfected the formula of selling to imbeciles, dude. I mean, like that's the they thing. Really the, have, the, yeah. have you okay? Like, no offense to anybody who actually plays Call of Duty. If you play Call of Duty and you enjoy it because you know, I won't lie. Modern Warfare. The people who write the storyline for that honestly do a pretty damn good job because the storyline's actually not half bad. Not Modern half Warfare Two storyline was actually genuinely kind of cool and enjoyable. It not to mention, bad. fucking Hans Zimmer wrote the music for the game. Which just made me like, I actually own that soundtrack, and I hate Call of Duty. I was like, holy fuck, I own a Call of Duty soundtrack. Just own just own Zimmer. A soundtrack, no. considering all here is Hans, da, 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 da. Hans Zimmer. Hans Zimmer did a fantastic fucking job with Modern Warfare. The storyline was good until Spec Ops: The Line came along and showed us that we're all fucking idiots. Yeah, That's kind that of, was a good well, fucking like, game. If you haven't played Spec Ops: The Line. Play it. It's, it's fucking awesome. It's, it's kind of like Halo game. series. It will make fucking you hate yourself. When the Halo series went game. to like ODST, I was like, okay, I'm done. I cannot play the ODST. Oh, ODST was, was a, great, yeah. dude! It was, it was a Firefly <laughs> fanfic! Really? It was a Firefly <laughs> fanfic! I could not play it. I was like, <laughs> I got to the point but Captain where Malcolm like, Reynolds now, now commands an ODST now. command squad and has to go fucking Kale Elliots. Along with Butch, along with fucking Jane, and Wash. I will give. Okay. I'm not the biggest... I'm not a very big fan of Halo. I'm not gonna lie. I like the original one. Yeah. Two was fun because me and my friend Marathon threw heroic mode and co-op in one night. Um, <laughs> but it? I will give them one thing that the, no other company has really managed to do is they have perfected the art of marketing through the masses. Yeah. They've integrated shit oh. like Rooster Teeth. They've integrated shit like uh, oh, Halo happen. Forward Unto Dawn. That was fucking amazing. That was the shit. Amazing. Okay, but here's the <laughs> thing. Let, let me. Yeah. 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 Well, let, let me let me it, stop right. you here. I'm officially done with Halo. Okay. Tux Tux knows because remember Tux when I bought Halo Four, you came over and you played it, right? Uh, Tux played a first person right. shooter. I drink to forget that. There's, yeah. Nothing, yeah. there's nothing else they can do. No, with no, it. no, no, no. Here's the fucking they, problem. They can't here's the more. fucking problem. They call the duty did. Yeah, they, they literally turned, just proceeded to be. They turned the multiplayer. They spent four hours on the campaign, and like, okay, so the rest of the game is just strictly dedicated to multiplayer. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And I was like, I no! That. What the fuck are you doing? I, I, I play that. Halo that's for the what, story. I play Halo for the fucking campaign. I don't. I don't play it for the fucking okay. multiplayer. Like, what? The ninety percent of the of the value now. Is in the map editor and creating shit for Rooster Teeth's Halo thing. <laughs> no, no, but here's yeah, the thing. Is. Here's the thing. Something Halo Force Forge mode. Bar. Halo Force Forge mode sucks dick. They had no Forge World map, so it was all you had was the basic maps. Yeah. yeah. And none of them gave you any creative like anything. Yeah. It was I bullshit. It. I was like, what the fuck is this shit? Yeah, like, that's what I'm saying. You make challenge maps with it. That's all you can. do. It's so fucking stupid, though. I mean, like honestly, like I hate watching a series that I loved get just decimated into such a mass-produced bullshit <laughs> marathon. Like, I mean, that's that's Halo. I mean, you want to play a real fucking game that's going to keep you engrossed for, like, 12 fucking hours? You want to play a game that's going to get you play fucking Dragon Age. I still have not beaten that game, and I've got over 10 fucking hours on it, because I've just gotten so goddamn sidetracked by everything. Dragon Age or Dragon Age Dragon Age 1. Oh, I've already beaten Well, Well, I know you have, Steven, but I haven't, so take my fucking time with it. Except, what would you think of 2? I liked it. Two. I enjoyed it. I liked two. I didn't like the story, but the thing that I liked is that they well, redefined the, the fighting I, I, formula. I, 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 yeah, actually, that's what I liked about it. But I, I also kind of felt like it was yeah, really like, like, I thought it was okay and everything, game. but 
Like, I, you could really tell they reused graphics a lot yeah, they in did. that. Like, yeah, they did. But the thing is, I mean, honestly, like, the thing is, I mean, like, <laughs> if you want to take if you want to take a really fun game, which I've, I've played a few times, I've never beaten it full through. I want to go buy it. It's The Witcher 2. The Witcher 2 is awesome. You know, that my step is always cool. telling me, like, you go to play The Witcher 1, because she said it's really good. Uh, uh, what she said The Witcher uh, 1 was good, but uh, uh, I don't know. The problem is The Witcher is just unbelievably juvenile. It's old, though. That's the problem. It's just unbelievably. Are you talking about the first one? Yeah. 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 The pro, The Witcher. It. You feel insulted to be in its demographic. Yeah. When you're done, yeah. you're like, "Wow, this is for twelve year olds." Yep. But The Witcher Two was more adult and better, and more better written. It was fucking cool. He plays this dude as every assassin of kings. You run around fucking wow and just kill people, and that was fun. Um. It's, 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 it's almost on like sale. it's almost like Assassin's Creed didn't people. exist. Yeah. I think it's on sale right now. You could probably find it oh, at GameStop yeah, for like yeah, yeah, yeah. cheap though. Yeah, okay, let's talk about something else. I mean, uh, Jesus fucking Christ, we're just talking about video games. I want to call it Battlefield. You mean the internet isn't flooded with that? Did you see that video? The internet isn't flooded with video game podcasts? <laughs> I know, All right? right? Did you see that video, of the little Machinima video, or the, of the guy walks let's, out? Let's not talk about Machinima, because right. I think that industry is yeah. involved in let's, bullshit. Let's avoid that. I hate, you know, it's that bad. Now it has. It's that bad. But back then it's it was that good. bad. It was good. It's that bad. I'm not saying it's I'm that not, bad. I'm not saying it's I'm that bad. It's that bad, Steven. <laughs> it's that bad. Let's Everyone gets beaten. It. All right, we'll keep it there. Okay, Machinima is just like, okay, guys, so uh, how can we totally rip off every Gary Mod comedy movie that's ever come out, yeah. but with different games, and just have shitty riff track to every other game where we, like, bob their heads like this so it looks like they're talking, but it's not funny at all because we just want to rip off Red versus Blue. It, 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 no one can see you, but... <laughs> <laughs> he explained it. Hey, Bob, <laughs> <laughs> hey, Bob, <laughs> like basically, no, if I it, it's like where they like, where they like move the cursor up and down so it looks like they're fucking bobbing their heads. It, it, it's like jacking like themselves off. Yeah. And they're like, it, it, hey, how you okay. doing? How if you, you were doing? here, if, if you were here, it was like watching Michael J. Fox having a seizure. Oh, oh, oh that is fucking that out. Edit that out. Oh Edit that out. God, that's low. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, that's okay, okay, okay. Low. Oh, have you come guys, on. Have you, have you I guys... can understand making fun of Christopher Reeve. He was a fucking asshole. But Michael J. Michael Fox, J. Fox is a good guy. Doc, hey, Doc. Have you guys seen the thing where he's making that movie? What's the one where he's with, with the judge? He's still fucking acting. Yeah, he is. But what's that movie where it's he... unbelievable. What, what's that movie where he was with the I judge? I respect him, but, you know... Judge. judge. There was a movie where he played this dude who was... Jackson, with, Michael J. Fox. My, yeah, Michael J. Fox, where he was with the judge. I can't remember what fucking movie was. But anyway, I, I was watching this the other day. It was a video where, like, they had so many outtakes because he would constantly call the dude Doc instead of calling him the judge. Uh. He's like, Doc, we got it. Fuck! Uh. And he's going... Fuck! God damn it! I'm still in Back to the Future. <laughs> hey, oh, hey, Doc, we oh, got it. Damn it! I did it. Again. I'm, just, I'm, I'm just gonna throw this out there. Spin City, one of the most underrated TV shows ever. Yes. I've never seen Spin City. It's fucking hilarious. I've seen episodes. I'm what is good. what is about? It's my. It was Michael J. Fox as like the mayor of New York's aide, and just all the you know just bizarre and incompetent people he works with. It's. I want to watch this. It's did, great. Did you by chance? Okay, you showed that picture of the Luna's coin. On Facebook, and I, you said when I said seashells, I was hoping you were gonna catch the hint of the three seashells. Do you know what movie I'm talking about? What the fuck are you talking you about? Seen, you ever seen Demolition Man? The Demolition Man with Wesley Snipes and Sylvester oh, Stallone no. when he gets uh, is it Wesley Snipes that black dude who looks like Denzel Washington? <laughs> Uh, no, he's yeah. Blade. Yeah. Oh, Dude. Blade! There we go. How the fuck do you not know who that is? You never saw the movie of Demolition Man? Okay, if you haven't, you gotta see it because it's actually really good because there was a point in the movie where it's like, hey, he hey, comes hey, out hey, of the restaurant. Wait, 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 read my fucking lips. I don't fucking care. <laughs> I don't fucking care if you don't fucking care. <laughs> we're over fucking anyway, he, talk, he comes out and says, I don't understand the three the three se- seashells. And he's like, it comes out of the bathroom and he's like, it goes up to, I don't remember her name. Uh, um, no, I remember, I know what you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, he goes up to the woman and he's like, I, was like, I don't, like, I'm gonna, I just got out of the bath- bathroom, but what, I don't what understand the three, the three seashells. seashells. She's like, Oh, uh, he doesn't understand the three seashells. Does he row? No, he doesn't row. He never rows. He doesn't, doesn't row. row. He doesn't row. Do you what? bite your he thumb? He doesn't at- row. Do you oh. bite your thumb at us, sir? No, sir, but I do bite my thumb. I do sir. hate it. That's how a they classical ignore- shit. Right I do there. hate it how they so ignored good. him at that point. It's like every time he's like, "Hey guys, guys, hey," they're like, "We're just gonna ignore." Him. Does he row? No, he doesn't row. Hey guys, I'm trying to talk to you. <laughs> FYI, we're in an hour and three minutes. Oh, but- stop. 
I bite my thumb at you. <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> exactly. Dude. There you go. It looks like I'm going to be cleaning the top of your gum right or something like that. You yeah. are dumb as fuck. Hang on. <laughs> That's what he's doing! Steven's yeah. about to get fucking punched right now. The traveling punch. <laughs> the traveling oh. punch. Okay, once again, there. Not there. <laughs> not there. Not there. Not there. there. There's seven of you. You can't decide which one to hit. Yeah, but it's like, hey, <laughs> fuck you, I'm not drunk. I know. I, are you yeah. sure? Because you but can't you hit sure the right spot. But you sure can't try. I okay. can try, but I won't get there tonight. Okay. <laughs> Seth, let's bring it home, man. All right, so. Find some closing remarks. So, uh, this is this has been the first, um, uh, what are we fucking called again? Edit that out. I totally forgot the name of it. I don't fucking remember. Remember, we've been, been drinking. Well, we're not really sober by this point. He has so. not been drinking. I have. I've been drinking moss. Actually, no, I really have re- He's reverse drunk. I, I'm, reversing. <laughs> I'm reversing right now. He's reversed. I'm just dumb. Um, <laughs> so, I guess, well, really I guess, uh, let's edit that out. I think we'll probably edit some shit. <laughs> Something will hey, go away. Hey, fucking, you don't own this shit. I don't, I don't think we're done. Some parts of this no. will go We're done. It's an hour and a half. I'll tell you what, I'll stop recording, I'll leave the mic up, and you can say whatever you want to it. <laughs> That will definitely be edited out. Yes. All right, so All of um, it will be edited closing out. remarks. Thank you guys for listening. I hope you guys enjoy our. Fucking if you did actually cameras. listen, we love both of you. And well, we obviously, you next time. Oh, never mind. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to bring logic into this. It won't matter. <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean? Don't you ever bring logic into this? All right. Well, uh, um, I hope. Yeah, you guys... I mean, like, look what you're dealing with. You're dealing with me and Sebastian.